Hello everybody and welcome back. Today we're going to be playing some Capes of Code. Now I wouldn't be lying if I was 100% set to play this. Because uh, streaming this. So, I don't know. See how it goes. Hey! Thanks Twitch for telling me that I'm recording you son of a bitch. Most useless fucking thing on the phone I've ever heard of. It lets you know that it's got a desktop um, manager on your phone. That's stupid. Nah, I'm stupid for not fucking shutting off the ringtone, so I guess. Either way. Either way. Okay, we're going to be playing. Now, I've played this quite a long time ago. So I just gotta try and remember stuff. Ego is, uh, I believe, what powers your... No, I think Ego's um, influence on price. Intelligence, I believe, is what. Yeah. Skill points, abilities, and artifacts. Will power is what? Cooldowns are activated abilities, determines your ability to resist mental attacks, and modifies your hit point regeneration rate. Potency. No, yeah, the ego is the one for potency of mutations. I was like looking at the screen forever and did not read it. Um, I guess we'll... Hmm. I feel like we'll probably end up having to cut something eventually. I want higher agility. Higher toughness. We'll see how much we could get up, and then we'll go from there. Oh. Use the number of skill points and your ability to examine artifacts. Do 12. Hmm. It seems like it's gotta be pretty high up. It's gotta be like 18 for another skill point. Determines your number of skill points and your ability to examine artifacts. I wonder if that's when you're leveling up. I can't remember. It's been a while. Your power score modifies the cooldowns of your activated abilities. Determines your ability to resist mental attacks and modifies... Oh, I want that up some. Oh, let's get that to 20. We're gonna burn some motherfuckers. Toughness. Um... Toughness, toughness, and agility. Yeah, I guess if you're faster, they're not gonna be able to hit you as much, would it? Would they? I think uh, I'm gonna deal with these. I yeah, haven't played these in such a long, played this in such a long time. Physical mutations, yes, that's something I do know. Flaming hands. You can't have flaming hands. I mean, you can't have freezing hands if you have flaming hands. Um, we're gonna be a crazy looking motherfucker. We're gonna have carapace, pace, flaming hands. We're gonna have some. Oh shit, night vision would be nice, wouldn't it? Night vision. How many? Oh shit, got two points. Oh, synthetic skin, sleep gas, slime glands, thick fur. What? Sleep gas? What? At least a gas is burst around yourself. At least gas for one round. Or, you know what? We're gonna maybe try that. I got flaming hands, night vision, and I'll probably have a sword of some sort. Oh, no, wait. There we go. So we can see in the dark. We have hands of fire and a sleep gas generation and a carapace. It's a really good armor. And we have a plus 400 reputation with tortoises. That was one I did not know. Um, we'll be. I think Ego also. 
influences your price you get for buying and selling you uh, stuff. We got intimidate, proselytize, um, skills, gadget, inspector, scavengery, spry dodge, short blade, expertise. I kind of like the dodge. That'd be nice if we got that right off the bat. Minus one strength. That's okay. We have reputation with bears. Steady hands, pistols, weak spotter, 200. Um, skills, long blade, proficiency. Uh, apostle, plus two the ego, or water vine farmer. It would give us the next uh, thing. Um, snake oiler. Allowed entrances to many settlements for purposes of trade. Starts with trade goods. We go. Mop blade proficiency, block, shield slam, steady hands. Yeah, I think I want to do this. Our character build code is page A Q L K G J O B C B H B P B U. That's about as fast as I could read right now. Let's begin the fucking game. What is your name? What is my name? My name is Bert. That is what it is. On the 23rd of Schwat Ux, you arrive at the Oasis Hamlet of Jopa, along the far rim of Margri. <sighs> Mr. Buckaloo, Buckaloo, and Pyro, what, Manser, whatever your name is. I cannot read these words. Magra Yi, the Great Salt Desert. All around you, moisture farmers tend to grow a Viridian water vine. There are huts wrought from rock salt and bine, uh, brine stock. And their highs and cuds jungles strangle chrome sleepless and rusted archways to the earth. Further and beyond, the fabled, fabled spindle rises above the fray and pierces the cloud ribbon sky. We're in Jopa, people. It's been a while. Hello. A lot has changed since I've last been here. <laughs> this, um, nifty, sprited version is. Pretty nice. Ah, I love these sprites though. I mean, they're really good, but. I've played this one. This was, uh. What do you call it? ASCII. It's about the last time I played it. Yeah, so it's been uh, quite a long time. I've had it for a while. I've just been. Not really looking for a reason to play it, but. Uh, something. Oh shit, okay, we gotta go. It's one of these here. I thought it was an alt M. I might have broke everything. Is everything still working? Might be. Okay, I will stop clicking random buttons. Oh, there we go. Manage abilities. Oh, I wanna. There we go, map key. Jesus, that was A. I, th I could have swore it was M, but I'd be wrong. Um, Titan Carapace, I never use this. I mean, you're like dead. Um, Flaming Hands, that's gonna be... The hardest thing for me is that I have no idea what keys are already used. So I have to keep, come up with the fucking craziest keys. I'm gonna use Right, we're gonna make this one. I guess control this. Control semicolon. And you could be toggled off. Oh. 
quotes. Tank Carapace, you'll be last resort. We'll be... No, I think we need those keys for going up and down stairs. So it's got to be something like... Control that one. Be like, bam, 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 bam. Okay, those four. Stance is aggressive stance. This is different. Half pen, uh, plus half penetration. Uh, minus two, minus four DV while wielding a long blade in your primary hand. Plus two DV, three DV while wielding a long blade in your primary hand. Sounds like defensive stance is the best way to go. There's no downside. Defensive stance it is. Shield slam is an attack that we get to use. You could be... Oh, I didn't mean to do shift. Oh shit, I started doing it for all of them. Shift quotes. Control. Control quotes. Oops, nope, that's not what I meant. Control. What are you on? OEM6. Oh, you're probably on this. Backslash. Nope, maybe not. Quotes, semicolon, open brackets. No, I'm missing the other open bracket. Uh... Nope, not that one. There we go. Mark target. Oh, shit. There's way too many keys for me to have to do here. I'll do... I don't know. Shift open bracket? Oh, Jesus. I usually end up making that just enter. Oh, well, maybe not. I don't know. I could end up becoming a hassle later or something, I think. Make it shift. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I think we're finally ready. This is not owned by you. Are you sure you want to open it? Yes, there's nobody here to see me steal this battle axe. There's nothing wrong here, guys. I'm just walking through. Close that door. Slip on over here. Chest. See what's inside? It's a copper nugget. We could use that. Nice to know some things don't change. People leave their doors unlocked for us to come in and steal all their bullshit. Joppa, it's a hell of a place. It's not owned by you, sure? Of course. You got a cool quilted shawl. I don't know what that exactly means there, but she'll be great. I'll get that. Burnt. We'll take that to sell. Hand axe. Copper nugget. Nothing over there. Nothing over there. Okay. We happen to found all these goods we can just sell. Hello. Oh, I forgot how to talk. New. No. See. There. There we go. Got treated. T assisted trade. Um. Uh, we could ask Tam. Uh, is it Tam or just Tom? I guess we'll say Tam. What kind of creature are you? I'm a dromad human. A salt strider. Eh. Uh, 
Okay. Well, we're gonna trade. Sorry for this awkward conversation. We can't wear armor. That's for sale. Um, this mask, I don't know. I don't know what this quilted shawl exactly does. Maybe just get rid of it. You could use shawls and stuff. You just can't wear armor because we got the carapace. Which would bark. Oh, that's free. I think you could, like, eat that. Um, yep. All 22 of our torches. Hand axe, yep. Iron battle axe, yep. Do you have a sword over there before I go crazy with that shit? Sword, 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 sword. Doesn't look... Okay, thank God. Alright. Bronze long sword. A steel long sword. Can we get it? Please. Yes. Are you kidding me? Awesome. What a great way to start out the game. We just need to offer up 33 because we just traded so much shit. Yeah, we we're good. See ya. Sucka. Alright, we need to wield. Nope. Nope. It's gonna take a while for me to get used to these. Steel long sword, we need the equipped auto lee. Counterweighted iron long sword. Six one D four. This better not be better than what we just got. I'll not be happy. Seven one D six. Six one D four. Oh so much better. Hey, you got something else to sell you. What kind of creature are you? No. I already read that. As great as it is. Um, no, we need to go on our side and sell this counter weighted iron longsword. That's not as good as the one we just bought from you. Ah, uh, spec gauntlets. We might be able to use gauntlets. A horned helm. Ooh, that's expensive. We do not have that much. Mm, weird artifact, data disk, star apple, fine wafers, bandages. Oh, regeneration is a good one to get to. A shield. I don't know what that minus, the circly thing minus one is. I don't know what the diamond thing is. Minus one. Yeah, I, you know, I, I don't know what the hell this thing does. Let's just get rid of it. It's only one, one dollar. Um, bandages. Is that two for ten? Ooh, yes it is. That's quite the amount of money. Um, actually, I think we'll technically still make this. Oh, but we're trading 15, too. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Um, offer. I need the pony up 16 drams of water. You need the pony up 16 drams of water, you son of a bitch. <sighs> Let's decrease the amount we want here. We'll get five. We'll get half of them. Yes. Gracias. Can I wait? This is Argive. This has been quite a while since I actually knew this. You are somebody else that I can't remember. Let's see ya. Is he a lot of the six days of silt, uh, stilt? Wander orphan of the salt, hear me. To the north and the west, through the great salt desert, the six day stilt splits the earth in two. Seek there the grandeur of Shekinah. First, among fathers. Release yourself from the burden that chrome bears on your sickly flesh. 
You intrigue me. I'll make the journey and see the six days still for myself. What wait what waits for me what waits for me there? Jesus. Hold your tongue, soothsayer, the salt pools and blood beneath the feet of those who dare command me. Um now we're gonna We're gonna pass. Live and drink, Wayfarer. Welcome to the oasis of Joppa. Here you will find shade and vittle, along with or vital? I don't know. Along with other provisions to help you better sour scour the rust caves for treasure. Above all else, you may drink of fresh water and quench your thirst. <sighs> Should I read through all these? This is Elder Ruadad, by the way. Ruadad. Thirst is mine, my water is yours. Begin water ritual, one dram of water. Bring it. Ah, uh, we share water with Elder Rudad and become begin the water ritual. Your reputation with the villagers of Chapa changed by a hundred. Because they despise Elder Rudad, your reputation with robots has changed by a minus one hundred. Because they despise Elder Rudad, your reputation with the Gersh changed by one hundred. Fuck you. Leave, live and drink, and we end the water ritual. Tell this. Additional, or you can award an additional hundred. Hmm. All right. We, uh, is there work to be found here? Uh, the moisture farmers are having trouble with the cave vermin. Speak with men by the water vine patch, or you can chat with Ol Argive, the southwest corner of the village. He's always looking for some poor fool to help him with his contraptions. Oh. Oh. We are well acquainted with Argive and his weird contraptions and his bullshit. Don't need to tell me again. We know. All right, mister. Whoops, I missed by a mile. Live and drink, friend. May you find shade in Joppa. I'm in search of work. You know what, actually? I want to steal all your vine wafers for 2.02 drams of water each. I'm going to be set for life. There we go. I have to pony up 4 drams of water. You know what? I don't think I have any water. Damn. All right, we'll get half. How about that? Best I could do, you sir. I want these vine wafers, but I'm not giving you just infinite amounts of uh, three jams of fresh water to open up the trade. <sighs> I just freaked out the dogs. Um. I don't have anything I like want to give you. Question mark. Wait, is that like a minimum of drams? Because that would make sense. Because I was literally stealing this guy's vine wafers for years. I just whoops. I come back and take all the vine wafers, and he's like, "Oh, have a good time over there. You only cleaned me out." Your egos got me down a point zero two per vine wafer. Okay. Two. Two drams. Are we completely out? Hmm. Yeah, we are, I guess. Or no, we're doing trading. Doesn't matter, I have money. He's just a different kind of folk. Let's see if we can get some from this dude. There's nothing to trade, huh? Well, you can all fuck yourself. Let's see, what can you tell me about Joppa? I am looking for some work. Some critters are eating our water vine. Fruit claims he saw one slinking around a vine patch. Ugly little thing. He says, pale white. Eight legs and ear splitting wine. I noticed a bit of red dirt in the water vine pool. The same we find in the soil at nearby cave to the north we call Red Rock. 
travel to the Red Rock and kill as many of these critters as you can. Bring back the corpse of one, two. Oh, one, two. Not one or two. One and two. Elder your dad will reward you for your efforts. I will do as you ask. What's eating the water vines? I think we'll go head off into his quest, but you know what? We better go check with Argive. Because, um... We could probably do one of his quests at the same time. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, hint, hint. Yeah, he doesn't care that we have money. He wants to do a straight up trade. Well, that's great that I just sold all my fucking shit. Oh, I probably fucked up so bad, too. Probably bought, like, shit that wasn't even close. I, I think I fucked up. I see it now. You don't have to yell at me. Alright, well... Fuck. Oh, well. We'll just have to go on quest to get money. Make it back. Mumbling. Tensil strength of Rublon, but lacking in dino elasticity. Retro threading the M band would probably. Oh! I didn't notice you there. That's because I was ignoring you. Uh, no doing trace shield with synthetic linseed solvent. I expect a deviation from the clank constant. Mm. Let's you disturb me. What are you? Some sort of treasure hunter? At the very least, make yourself useful. Bring me a knick-knack from one of the caves. Pfft, I may reward you. There are caves everywhere, you dolt. This is Cud! Try the rust wells, just east of here. I've got it, Argive. We will go on this quest. Bam, bam, bam. Go to the world map by pressing minus on the numpad. From any surface zone, you can return to the region surface by pressing plus on the numpad. Or down for going down. Yeah, just a water viner over here. You discover a rust bog. You note the location of rust bog in the locations. Natural features section of your journal. Uh, uh, shit. I'm not ecstatic about making it to this rust bog. As long as there's nothing that wants to kill me. Doesn't sound like there's anything... All that, um, interesting here. Can we cut down water vines? We're gonna need food. See? No. A for action. A for action. Nope. I is for action. Nope. Capital I. Nope. Tinkering. Skills. Oh, nice. I forgot about the skills. Good to know. I know one of these do something. Equipment. I don't think... I must have to have click every single one. I don't know what to do. No, throwing weapons equipped. Y, Y, U, I. Nope. Hey. Nope. Oh. Oh, I have a thrown weapon equipped, okay. Um, D. I have a missile weapon equipped. There's nothing to take. Right here, there's nothing to take. I will say it again, there's nothing to take. It's you. At least looking is the same. This is a dog thorn tree. Tangled nest of roots spill through the earth. The bark is splintered into pointy spines. The leaves are greasy and sticking. This is a kudzu. This plant is densely twisted, mat of metallic fibers and long, brilliant red fronds which wave gently towards you. An unfelt breeze. Is it really waving because of a breeze? Or is it just fucking sentient once they eat you? Right, I can't remember if that's the one that rusts your shit. 
or if it's the one that, like, tries to fucking grapple and eat your ass. Either way, it's not fun time. Fucking scary bullshit. I just be like, nope. I don't know what the hell you are. I don't want none of it. All right. I don't know how to interact with shit. Apparently. All right. Go down here. We'll check out these. Go back and forth a couple times. Make sure we're not being shot, and we'll open. But yeah. Ooh, look at all these weird artifacts. We'll get that one. Aha! We didn't even have to go with the caves. Our guy, if we did it. This is like the easiest quest I've ever done. Oh, look at this, more! What the hell's an emergency service? It's a security card. I wanna look at it. Paper thin access card, which uh, will open some doors in the depths of CUD. Hmm. I'll be hanging on to that one. No, no doubt about it. Alright. Um, it looks like we probably cleared this place out. I don't like how the, like, things keep popping up calling me trash. Salty water. Yep. This is cud. No fresh water anywhere ever. You will die out here. You will... Thirst to death. Alright, well, let's just head back. Maybe we'll make some money. We're coming back! Our guy, we finished your stupid quest. We pretty much just walked out 10 feet and found you some shit. Here's your knickknack, Paddywhack. Select an artifact to give. Hmm. So many to choose from. You're standing in my light. What do you want? Here's your weird artifact. You finished the step. Return to Argive of the quest fetch Argive and Knickknack. You used 75 XP. And you completed it. If I must. Ah, oh, appears you may be useful after all. Now go fetch me another trinket. Oh. My good friend, I have already fetched you said trinket. There you go. You have gained a level. You are now level 2. You gain 1 hit point, 58 skill points, and 1 mutation point. Complete the fetch archive another knickknack. Good, good. Quite impressive, treasure hunter. Maybe you're fit to poke around my workshop here. I've been wanting another apprentice, so unfortunate what happened to Scruff. What with a disembowelment and all. Take a seat. Um, okay. Now let me explain, I'm on the cusp of a grand discovery. When I'm done assembling the weird wire conduit, you'll be able to speak to anyone from here to KFS. First though, I'm going to need some copper wire. As much as you can find, at least 200 feet. You should be able to scavenge enough from the rust wells and nearby caves. As you say... What the f What the fuck was that? I have never. Everybody see else see that music stuff? Hmm. All right, so we gotta go to the rust wells, and we also gotta go somewhere else. Let's travel. Whoops, you're lost. You're getting your bearings by exploring your surroundings. Uh, I didn't mean to go that way. I just wanted to, like, look. Press space. Alright. I just need to keep our cool. Maybe take a step through some salty water. Not that salty water over there. There's fish or something over there. Oh, we didn't find fresh water out here in the middle. Oh, shit! We're injured. Flee. He fleed with us. I'll lose him in the water. I am not losing him in the water. You need to leave me alone. Good sir. I am not a tasty morsel. If I knew you were a fucking crocodile, I would not have stepped on your ass. 
I'm gonna turn around and fucking fire blast you right in the face. Are you ready for this? Me neither. I need a fire arrow. There's flaming hands. Controls. Semi cold. Fire blast. In your face. Eat dick. Uh oh, he's wounded and flaming. Now I'm being chased by a flaming crocodile. Well, guess what? Sword to fossil. He's dead. We gained 75 XP. Suck a bitch. <sighs> We're just gonna wander on over. I don't see what happened to that car. Oh, he probably fucking vaporized. We just. Kamea made his ass, pretty much. Mmm. Draw bead. What is this? Spend a turn to draw bead on target market. Whenever you fire at a marked target with a bow or rifle, your agility. Oh. I don't have a pistol. We can't put anything into any of these yet. Let's see what else we got down here. Absolutely nothing. But again. Oh well. Alright. That's cool, dude. That's real cool. Um, we'll go over here. If we leveled up, we might have one point. We do. Length of effects. Aggressive stance. Should I manage to the hit while wielding a long blade in the primary hand? No, I don't want an aggressive hand stance. I want the other one. One that doesn't suck so bad. Um, yes, we're definitely giving our point and level to flaming hands. You emit jets of flame from your hands. Next level emits a nine square ray of flame in the direction of your choice. Cooldown 10 rounds, damage is 2d4 plus 1. And you cannot wear gloves. Well, we figured that one out. <sighs> Cost you 1 MP. Yep. Thank you. Can't wait to incinerate some fools. All that running away was just pretending. Oh, <gasps> we fucking goddamn it! Shit! Oh, thank God it was something else. Okay, so that's. I need to double check what you guys are. Not by touching you. Cause this planet is a densely twisted map of metallic fibers and long glowing red fronds, which wave gently towards you on an unfelt breeze. That is. Not really breeze, it's sentient, and it's the fucking creepiest thing you've ever seen. It's a uh, kudzu. Kudzus are the one that fucks your equipment up. I'll be keeping a great big distance away from them from now on. We will keep better eye out for alligators, because that sh probably should have killed us. We'll find our way out of here eventually. I found a road. Roads don't mean shit. What is this? And salty water. You gotta test every once in a while. If some, salt, if some water looks weird, just go ahead and step on it. It might be actual water, 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 water. And you'll be happy you did. Alright, we will figure out where we are eventually. Take a sip of fresh water. Where did we get fresh water from? I thought we were out. Um, can't eat 22 drams of fresh water. What the fuck? I thought we didn't have any. We're fine. We're. Oh shit! What the hell are you? A chitinous puma? What the hell? Oh my god. 1d3. 
Um, three damage. Well, that's not too bad. I will fucking... Oh! You done goofed. Flaming hands. Whoops. No, I don't want to target myself. Whoop, shit! God damn it, that cat was confused. Oh, there we go. I clicked the wrong button. There we go. Eat dick, you bitch! Oh, run away, we're dying. Help! The flaming chitinous puma's fine? Oh, there's two of them. Shit. <gasps> Shit, we're gonna die! Um. Other way to go. Get tight on our carapace. I should want to find tight carapace. It's open brackets. You tighten your carapace. Your AV improves by three. Um. It's armored. Yes. Okay, now we'll try something else that saved us. Um, we need to do only a backslash. This shit is pretty much empty here. Oh, shit! We died. Ugh. We're doing so good. I thought I was going to go the distance. I forgot how fucking dangerous Cud was. Never underestimate Cud. I've learned a lesson today. I should have learned this lesson. <sighs> lesson like 20 years ago. Whenever I first played this. But, you know, I just never learned. Just rush head along in there and run into Chitness Puma. Try running away and run into two Chitness Pumas. Go through the fucking uh, edge of the map. Step on an alligator. Piss one off. Oh, the most advanced artifact in your possession was a Vibro Dagger. Damn. I think you might... Could you get Argive the... Identify stuff? That would've been cool. Oh boy. On the 23rd of Schwat you arrived at Joppa in sacred ritual. You shared your water with Elder Ruidad. You fetched a trinket for an old man. You fetched another trinket for the old man. 24th of Schwat you were killed by a chitinous puma. Didn't get very far, Burton. Try next time. This is brutal. New game. Um, I think I liked our character. Try replaying it. Oh, time is it? Nine thirty, huh? Well, I got about another hour in me. But I think I'm gonna end this video here because this is broken up in the videos. But I'm streaming it on Twitch for the hell of it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. Let me know what you want to see more. Caves of Cud in the future. Um, on Twitch or on YouTube. Um, if you want to see more on Twitch, I guess go ahead and follow. This is a weird one for me to say because I never really do it. And uh, if you like what I do in general, go ahead and subscribe. Leave some kind of feedback. Want to say hey? I'll say hey back. Hey back.